Hey there, Builder Blog. I received a fun invite. So apparently, um, I got invited to the Future Games. You might be saying, what the heck is that? Because when I opened up the email, I was like, what the heck is this? Um, apparently, there's a new place to fight heavyweight robots. Or new-ish. New kinda? I'm not sure. Leave a comment if you know more about this thing than I do. So, um, Scorpios specifically, not, not just me, but Scorpios and the Scorpios team, specifically five members, um, got invited to the future games. They, uh, they offered me to ship my robot out, plane flights, and hotel, all covered, and, uh, I would get to compete in their heavyweight tournament. And supposedly with a half million dollar prize on the line. Now, this is very intriguing, to say the least. And, uh, well, I guess this is my question for you, Builder Vlog. Would you say yes? Uh, the gentleman who invited me, I actually do know him from the early games of competing or the early days of competing at Robo Games, he was a fellow contestant, also in the 30 pound division. And uh, I do actually remember fighting against him. I don't know if he remembers fighting me or destroying me, but I, I was just a 13 year old kid back then. We're a fairly small community. Word gets around pretty quick. <laughs> so my question is, Builder Blog, would would you ship your $50,000 robot to a country you've never been to? All for a chance to fight for half a million dollars? Would you? Would you? Would you put 50k in a box and do that? Tell me. Because I, uh, I often say I try to have this blog um, be what it's like to be a BattleBots driver and a BattleBots captain. And this is one of those moments where I have to really captain, like put the hat on and everything. Because I, I have to decide, are me and four of my teammates going to Abu Dhabi? I mean, I'm pretty sure that's where uh, Garfield was trying to mail Nermal. And uh, literally completely on the other side of the world. And uh, show up with my tools. And like when I did this in South Korea, at the IRC, um, like the power outlets are different. It's actually really hard to go win a robot tournament in another country, which makes in-game winning the giant nut even more impressive. So like when your tools don't work, when none of your normal equipment works, when you can't even charge the batteries on your hand drill, much less the batteries in your robot, and you're kind of relying on the local builders or doing your own research about the power systems before you get down there, it's, um, and all that aside, it's a new tournament. Hey there, Builder Blog. So a couple weeks ago, Zach told you to tell us what your favorite part about NHRL was. And Craig Danby gave us a piece of his new robot as a giveaway. So we forgot to do the follow-up to the giveaway last week. So let's give it over to Nolan and Freya and see who they picked for this week's winner. Rawr! This week's winner is Norris Vaughn. He likes the creativity that goes into making the robots. And yeah, Builder Blog. I know there's been a lot of questions about Project Extinction, the 12 pound battle bots. I'm kind of at the mercy of BattleBots when they decide to do another thing. We have one of the giant washers. I'm expecting them to send us back to compete against everyone else who won the giant washers. But uh, until they finish airing that, I don't know. And I'm gonna keep going to Norwalk and other random tournaments. Hell, leave a comment if there's a tournament you want me to go to. Let me know. Anyway, back to the main video. They're doing drone races. They're doing a bunch of other stuff. The reason they're calling it future games is they're trying to be like the future of motorsports. So there's esports there, drone racing there, and they want robot combat. And not just robot combat, big robot combat. 
So, I don't know. What do you think, Belderblog? Should we take a trip? Should we go to Abu Dhabi? Put it in the comments. Tell me. What would you do? What would you do? What do you know? So, I know this is a relatively short week. I've actually been killing myself trying to make a mini hypershock. And my god, Will, how many lines and non parallel angles did you need? All of them. Anyway, I'm I am going to put a video up about that and I I'm also working on a video about rebuilding the 12 pounder and the new design. So um until then, I'm going to contemplate Abu Dhabi and what I would have to do to Scorpios to get him ready. What would I do with half a million dollars in prize money? All the questions to be answered. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you next week. Hello, boys. Hello, Norman. Are you with all your black cat buddies? Is it your favorite time of year? Yes. Yes, it is. Just doing cat things with cat friends in the spooky season. Bubba's. 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 And you leave.